makeup that I packed. It's actually a pretty light packing job for me. This is the makeup bag from Laura Lee Los Angeles. I got it in that mystery box that I ordered from her and it's a great size. It's really long. It fits a lot of stuff all up in here. This little pouch, I have lip liners and I'll go through the products. I just laid my brushes, like my face brushes on top and everything flat underneath. And yeah, there's not too much, but I'm gonna dig into the products. All righty, I'm gonna go through the products that I packed and then you can see a little quick run through of this fast daily makeup routine. But I tried to limit what I packed and up here you see my my usual brow products grow brow pencil the nyx brow glue and the nyx brow pen then i packed an eyeshadow primer the alamar cosmetics one that's in a tube it's just easy i also packed my go-to lip combinations with a few lip liner options the carly bible one and then my fave steve laurent lip liner in the shade chic and then these are my three favorite stick lipsticks this is the new carly bible um in the shade taurus this is saucy gal from artist couture and this is cake from the glossier generation g lipstick line i just packed a few eyeshadow brushes and for me it's always important to have blending brushes a definer brush a shader brush and then uh like a pencil brush. So I got my Sigma definer brush. I packed a couple of, or a few double-sided brushes. So I had options. These each have shader brushes, the Sigma one, and then the ABH one. And then this is a mini dose of colors brush. And it has a pencil brush and I like on one end. And then I like that it has, this gives me like two small blending brushes and then two bigger ones. So that's it for eyes. As far as face brushes go, that is all um, connected to the different complexion products I packed. So I packed this BB cream because it has SPF and it's just lightweight and hydrating and easy to use because I'm not wearing a lot of makeup typically when I'm traveling or when I'm here. Two different concealers just based on, they're my, uh, I've been using the Kosas at the moment, and then this Too Faced is my absolute favorite concealer, so I always like to have it because it is a tried and true. I packed this Hollywood Flawless Filter over the Auric, even though I use that one every day. Um, I packed it over that because this is a mini travel size. <clears throat> my mascara that I like that I've been using, my Laura Lee Los Angeles sponge. Laura Lee Los Angeles, again, the, the last products. Um, foundation brush, and then this angled brush for blush. Also packed that. A powder brush for bronzer, and then a highlighter brush. This is for the um, uh, cream products. That little duo fiber brush from ColourPop, and then this Real Techniques eyeshadow brush I use to set my under eyes and I packed my mini of my favorite NYX setting powder they sell it in a mini size now which is so convenient and also I recently had alert 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 the media I had an opinion change I decided it was time for me to change my attitude and give Jaclyn Cosmetics a try because enough she did enough, in my personal opinion, for my uh, collection and my, just in my opinion, she's grown a lot and it's very obvious, but I got the miniature size of her accent highlighter in the shade, what's it called? Iced. The mini one, perfect opportunity to travel with it. I brought, I wanted a bright blush because I've been jonesing to do some peach and orange eyeshadow looks so I wanted to bring peach and coral blushes and this is the medium colorette blush trio from Alamar and related I brought this physician's formula palette because face palettes are the best to travel with um, because now I have bronzer and blush and of course highlight here love 
these products. And then because I told you I had a couple of looks in mind, I brought the ColourPop Sweet Talk palette, shopped my stash because this is such a good peachy, pink, orangey toned palette. It's gonna do what I want. And then I threw in this palette, one, because it has a mirror and I needed something that had a mirror. And also this has all these bright colors and I want to use these and maybe the pink, maybe the purple, we'll see. But I just figured that this has this and then you know, all these neutral ones. So if I needed to just forget about that palette, I could. But yeah, that's what I've packed. I hope you enjoy seeing my quick little routine, but I'm nosy personally. So I like to see what and how people pack. And for me, this is a pretty light load. I obviously overpacked because I did not need to pack extra blush, extra highlight, or a second eyeshadow palette, or a second concealer, or a second lipstick. But I am me, and I wanted options just in case I changed my mind. And this is a really light packing job for me. Everything fit in one bag. Enjoy the look. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you.